The long journey. Who remembered it? I started a lightning talk last year in Kiev called The Long Journey. Maybe some people remember it. And this is me a year ago and talking about how I got introduced into the Pearl community a year ago and how I make a long, long, long distance by train to get to Kiev. And maybe you don't believe me, I made a long, long, long journey again by train to get to... What is it here? Sofia. At the end of the, <laughs> at the, end of the, the, the whole talk, I had this slide up, and if you're not so familiar with French, it's more or less me pondering which direction I would be going. And this is a talk about, well, a short thing about what happened a year after this. This happened. I went to a Euro tour promoting the Dutch Pearl, promo, uh, Pearl workshop. And I did some strange talks about Clash of the Slashes, doing number fraction things and nice things with that. Uh, I sent some people with the best wishes for the next year. Some uh, might have sent, uh, gotten this, uh, this Christmas card. Uh, I don't know who got it, but somebody might have gotten um, So what happened next to it? Um, I went to a nice hackathon, met some nice people over there, doing some naughty stuff, helping my daughter getting uh, a few thousand votes extra. By the way, she didn't win because they finally figured, hey, our server has been hacked. Uh, <laughs> it's called a hackathon, isn't it? Okay. <laughs> so what else happened? Uh, I think together with uh, Leon and Soria, we made a very, very good revival of the Dutch Pearl workshop. And the next thing that was happening, I was joining the team to get Yepsi Europe 2016 to happen in Amsterdam. So what is this all about journey and what is it having all in common? Why am I having this silly introduction? And what are these people having in common? Is it the nice language we have? Or maybe it's the nice things we are doing over and over again every month or week? Or maybe it's just the nice people we meet everywhere? I think there's one thing we have in common with this slide. Oh, we have it already. It's ACT. Isn't it? ACT binds everything together. The conferences bind together to ACT. Workshops, hackathons, you as attendees of the, uh, the nice events we have, people with special uh, roles in the whole thing, people that are organizing the whole thing, like admins, and then somebody very special. I haven't seen him yet. Is, has somebody seen Madding? Sebastian? No. He should be here. Anyways, we have one single system operator matting and doing the whole thing together, making sure that everything's up and running. Now, we all want something new. We want actually something that's called ACT Next Generation, maybe. And what should it have? Well, what about having user profiles and videos included for your talks? Or what about having these nice integrations with Twitter and Facebook? Or maybe you want a very nice web design of it. Or what about having a nice API? Let's build it on top of ACT. Well, forget about it. What is ACT now? ACT now, built by Book in 2004. It's using Apache. It's using something you said, oh, no, 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 don't do that ever. Don't do mod, mod pool one, okay? Uh, um, operated by one single guy, and well, unfortunately, no development and no future. What should it be? I think this is what it should be. <laughs> yeah, we should have a proper development team with fast servers and modern technology and all the other nice things, and we have hopefully a hackathon. So. Why this long thing? What's going to be my next step on my personal and maybe some people others long, long, long journey? I think this is my next step on the long journey. It's called Start Act Voyager. <laughs> and like every, uh, okay, the short star map, it will be having DBX class things, it will have a rewrite of the lib act core, it will have Dancer 2 as a big engine behind it. It will have, finally, a RESTful API and maybe all the goodies. Then, like the Act Voyager, oh, sorry, like the Enterprise Voyager, it needs a team. The real one has 140 people on the, 
nice starship and well, a crazy guy like me started setting up. I have a lucky, 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 lucky grant manager called Liz. She's helping me, she's going to make sure that I go the right direction. Luckily, I have somebody that's taking care of making sure that the thing will be healthy inside. <laughs> and of course, people making sure that the thing will move somewhere. Uh, the whole developer team of Dancer 2 is behind it. And well, what will be my next thing? Uh, okay. Luckily, I have been granted 6,000 US dollars. And I must say, the Pearl Foundation, thank you, thank you, thank you very much. And. Next year I hope to be here with another version of ACT and how I hope you will be very happy that the whole team that will be coming together tomorrow during lunch, lunch will be provided, I must say, don't worry, we will have your sandwiches ready, you might have to run for your cone or coffee, but I hope to see you next year in Granada <laughs> and the long, long journey. Thank you very much. Thank you.